I'm about to show you guys how to load up the Serato sample plugin in your MPC software and get to rocking and chopping. Stay tuned. You in the Dungeon Palace, boy. <laughs> What's up, guys? This is your boy DZD, aka the Drank King, Purple World Entertainment, Dungeon Palace Studios, thedrankking.com. And I really, really appreciate y'all tuning in to this video. Thank you guys so much. I'm going to do something a bit different. I know you guys see me making beats all the time, but this is going to be my first tutorial. I was asked a question on how to use the Serato sample plugin in the MPC software. So that's what the video is going to be about. I'm going to show you guys how to load up the Serato sample plugin and how to align the pads with the Serato sample plugin pads. That way you can do your thing and get to chopping on your, on your samples. This isn't a Serato sample tutorial on how to use Serato sample. There's a lot of videos on the internet if you'd like to go look them up and see how you can use Serato Sample and what are the features of it. All I'm going to do is just show you how to get it loaded in your MPC software and how to match up everything to where, to where your samples play fluent. So without further ado, let's get into the video. Okay, we have a blank sequence loaded up in the MPC software. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to load Serato Sample on the track and then we're going to get everything set up. So let's go to the software and we're going to go to track one. We're going to put plug in. We want to pick plug in. Then we want to pick Serato sample. Okay. Now we have that loaded up and now we want to have Serato sample uh, GUI pop up. There it is. So the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to load a sample. I think I have one. Let's just choose one of these. It's going to analyze the sample. It's going to load it into the soft, into a Serato sample. And there we are. So let's play the sample. So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to get Serato sample set up on the MPC pads. That way we can play the sample mapped out on every single one of the pads and everything falls in sequence. So to get this to do that, the first thing that you have to do is put it on pad perform. We're going to put the sample to the beginning. This is just an easy way. I like to do it. We drag the sample to the beginning. Right at the beginning. Then we go down here to, to this box here click the arrow and we put it on set slicer okay then we change this one here to 16 because there are 16 pads on the MPC software and then we're going to hit set slicer now what this does is it instantly maps out the different slices in Serato sample to the different pads on the MPC software so now what we want to do is make sure that all of our slices on Serato sample line up with the pads that are on the MPC. That way we can play the sample out in sequence and then we can set up a little pattern and arrangement so we can play our sample nice. So now what we want to do is go to the controller on the MPC and we want to go, we want to make sure that it's set to notes, not cards. We want to make sure that it's set to notes. And then we want to take the scale and the octave and we want to change that to to C because that's the that's that's where the the uh, the Serato sample is set up and then we want to make sure that the range is set to one and then we want to make sure that it's on chromatic not Dorian not any other not any other scale pattern we want to make sure that it's, that it's on chromatic so now when you look at Serato sample the pads will now line up all one after the other. So now your pads in Serato sample match the pads that are on the MPC. Thank you guys for tuning in. This concludes the video. I really appreciate the support. 
I have a lot more content that's coming to you, some beat making videos, I have some sample plugin reviews coming, I also have some full beat breakdown videos coming to you guys. So by all means, hit that subscribe button, hit that bell notification, that way you can keep up to date with the content that we have coming to you. Hopefully you got some value out of this video, now you can get to rocking and chopping with Serato Sample and your MPC software. I have a question for you guys, the producer community that's out there, I myself, I like to use a lot of sample based production, lay some samples down, and then I arrange around the samples with some instrumentation. I want to hear from you guys on what do you do and how do you have your sample based production or your instrumentation laid out in your software. Either you like sample based production or you like instrumentation or maybe you do some DJing on the side or whatever it is you do. But I really want to hear from you guys so please by all means leave me a comment let me know what's up with you. Once again thank you guys so much for tuning in. I really appreciate the support. This is your boy DZD, aka The Drink King, Purple World Entertainment, Dungeon Palace Studios. And always remember, music is life. Live it, love it. Catch you on the next video, guys. Take care.